I am even of the view that some of these state agencies, we have no business having deputies and even double, couple, two, three. We have no business because we cannot derive the needed productivity from them. And the economy is the function of productivity and the labor size. So I agree with you 100% that most of these outlays or expenditures are extremely unproductive. And probably the crisis is rather now drawing the attention of the government to look at these areas very well. And sometimes you can make projections and promises along the critical activity path of your work. You might have forgotten some of them, but crisis can let you review your work and know that I agree with you. I think state-owned agencies, we need to look at those. Me, for instance, I disagree having NAEP, YEA, EYA, Maslow, Capital Bench, I'm against it. They seem to be pro providing the same or offering the same services. Government can merge them, cut down expenditure on overheads and all these infrastructure and other things so we can save money. So for this one that you are raising, if I even argue with you, I'm not being an honest person. Okay. And I think our government should listen to some of these good things and quickly make changes in these areas. All right. Me, if I were, I had my discretion, I would delay all deputies. I'm not talking about ministries, state agencies. I will also let any land cruiser be used that is paid for by government, maintained by government, formed by government to be parked. So when you are driving outside your region, you can use, but in the capital towns, you use small cars. These are some of the things we all agree. So this statement, I'm sure right. they will listen. Mm. Nobody should attack me because I'm an MPP man. We want to save 